Go to w.gg and use code NOCHOICEGV for 10% off any order. No artificial colors, no fillers, zero calories, and zero sugar. Use code NOCHOICEGV, that's N-O-C-H-O-I-C-E-G-V, at checkout for 10% off. Thank you, W, for sponsoring this video. Look at that boat right over there. If only there was someone on the dock that could take me over there. I doubt that it. was a terrible way to start the episode. <laughs> Hello, everybody! My name's Mayhem! And I'm a better way to start the episode. Fuck you! <laughs> no! That's right! <laughs> and I'm with a dumbass! <laughs> and we're back with another episode of Dragon Quest. Uh, Eric got taken by the uh, Skull Guys, uh, the Gold Dudes, the Gilded Dudes, the Skull Gildenauts. Skull Guys all look at explosions. And we're gonna go, and we're gonna go save Eric and totally figure out his backstory right now. This is Whole Cake. It's real! Whole Cake Island? Yeah. Who's yeah. the cake? The gold. <laughs> Jinju. I have no idea who the cake could be. <laughs> Don't ever do that again. <laughs> Ish. The screen burn on the screen that we can see that you can't see is very painful. <laughs> Wait, is it there? What is it? It's the it's the switch burn? it's the switch menu. Because <laughs> <laughs> we were sitting on it waiting for <laughs> waiting for um, Duke to go finish using the bathroom or He's whatever. What about the business he needed to attend to? Why to take you, a piss. Why are you lower level than everyone else? Because everybody's better than me. <laughs> oh no, I remember. it's because you kept dying <laughs> to the last boss fight. Yeah. Nah, it was fine. To Booga. Booga was a bitch. I hate. Uh, I hate Booga. <laughs> I like Wario. <laughs> I hate Booga. I love Jane. Yes. And especially now that she has. I a love Silvando. Well, Duke, that's your thing to keep to yourself. Please continue <laughs> doing that. Let's say... Could this be the hideout of the Skull Guys? <laughs> Peek through the door. The, the greatest treasure of all. I love that voice. <laughs> Three cheers for kidnapping. He did especially well to bag this one. The boss has been after him for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> Could you at least introduce yourselves? This is Olaf. This is Olaf. This is Olaf. <laughs> this is Olaf. This is Olaf. And this is... David. <laughs> George. <laughs> Olaf! <laughs> oh, then that must mean you are... Yep. Gordon. <laughs> <laughs> I just love the idea that Eric's just like, and man, that they were so nice to me, but like, they're... there's no way that they actually came to save me. Like, they don't actually care about me. Hello! <laughs> Surprise, gay boys! You're golden. I'm here for my Vegeta. <laughs> I'm the I'm the the Skyrim fame saying no. No, no, no. <laughs> Not me. You're dead right, Chief. Dead right. <laughs> Hell yeah. No. I wonder where we have to go. Is it that one? Quite the celebrity, Hi, Jade. I can't say I'm not jealous. Why is her backhand like no that? Time for jokes, She's trying not to break a nail. To Eric, remember? <laughs> Honey, why are you holding your hand like that? My nails. You you I'm trying to protect them. Where's your spear? <laughs> hey, that was cheating. Who could have caused those empty seats to happen? Uh, us? Oh, fuck! The Gildan bitches. <laughs> For golden bitches. I'm 
There we go. It's a whole gang of Gildenot, which means your your group hitting moves will hit everyone. Which uh, wait, which wait. means Savannah can use swoosh. Swoosh. My uncle got to hold a gold bar once. Was it heavy? Was it? Yeah, I, was, I was about to say the same thing. <laughs> was it heavy? <laughs> yeah. Well, mind you, he was handed the bar, and he's like, okay, that's cool. And it's like, you know what you're holding right now, right? It's like, what? A pure gold. Like, you're literally holding probably, what, $20,000 worth right now? God damn. And just, my uncle just... I I don't know how to respond to this. <laughs> <laughs> do, do I put it down? <laughs> He's like, I don't worry, I can take that back now, but... She's just like, holy shit, how do you respond to that? How do you respond to, you're currently holding what is worth $20,000? Thanks. <laughs> Appreciate. Uh, the wait. material in your hand, conquistadors wanted to kill for that. They had, and they did. did. <laughs> and didn't get it. You see and that did not get it. You see that yellow brick right there in your hands? Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's worth more than your life, kid. People value that for some reason. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's shiny and Here. shiny big monkey go. Let me make it even crazier for you, kid. Takes the bar, hands you one that looks silverish. You see that one? That's the one the conquistadors ignored. You see the white brick? That's the one that people didn't like as much. This other white brick I have will get you high as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> That's just cocaine. <laughs> it was more valuable in the long run. <laughs> But no, handing them, like, a, a bar of platinum, and it's like, that's the thing that conquistadors didn't know was actually going to be valuable. Because they thought it was just silver. <laughs> yeah, they thought it was just silver, so they dumped it in the ocean. Uh, how do you tell, how do you tell if, why would you even get rid of silver at all? Even, okay, but how, how would you tell, gold. how would you tell the difference between silver and platinum? Is it like the, the way the color refract or the light refracts off of it? Uh, let that's me a, look it up. That's a good question, yeah. That's a good question. Thank you, Jade. <laughs> I'm just hitting them. I'm just trying to kill them all before they can kill Mesuk. <laughs> that is a good strategy. Especially with this. Yeah, Brother Gates. Yay. Hadouken. <laughs> Hadouken. Yay. Damn, nine. Kisses. You got nine fucking points. Kisses. I don't know what that does. It sizz, but better. Whoa. <laughs> You know, I don't believe you on that. I should get those. I should get Giga Crash, right? Uh, I mean, if you want. Because <laughs> I, because oh wait, no, actually, I should start. I should actually start working on my uh, Luminary area. If uh, you want, but... I mean, honestly, you you really need to grind some some levels and get more exp experience so you can have more skill points so you can fill out the tree a lot okay. sooner. So I should probably. I'll save for increased strength. Okay, I want to read both these fucking paragraphs I just read. Okay. Because fuck this guy. Uh, platinum is much denser than silver, so it will have more heft to it. Also, platinum isn't really white. It's actually a gray color. Second paragraph. The primary difference is that platinum is whiter, brighter, and shinier. It's So it's better... It's better contradiction! Brighter. Contradiction! 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 So at most, I understand that it's just heavier. Yeah. Basically, yeah. if you're holding two things that look like silver and one of them is heavier, that's probably platinum. Yeah. Mm. But if it looks more like silver at the same time. And if you're carrying silver and something that also looks like silver, but the one that's kind of silver is lighter, it's probably aluminum. Yeah. Uh, should if, I... if you're holding a thing of silver and you're holding aluminum foil, I think one of them might be aluminum. <laughs> <laughs> I should get pink typhoon. Beguile all enemies. You don't have enough points for it, but like, but like, should I save up for it? You can. I'll do that. Let's say the cutscene of us literally murdering everybody. <laughs> Eric is now terrified of us. <laughs> Sorry to leave you stewing in there, laddie. They didn't hurt you, did they? They had a bone to pick with me. Well, you're safe now. Let's head back to Sniffleheim. The priests worried sick about you. Aye. No. Something is still not right. Eric, what did those fiends do to you? They cut out my tongue. I well, you see what happened? Here. And they were... Yeah. So... She must be... She? I've... Gotta go. What does that mean? 
walks calmly to boss room. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> With no one following? Come on, darling. We'd better get after him. What do you want? Well, that was weird. <laughs> I wonder who Sylvana's voice actor is. He's he's very good. Guy in the chair. <gasps> Look up voice actor for Silver. Silverando. <laughs> Silver. <laughs> Silver Andy. Yeah. Yeah. That's actually a way funnier name. <laughs> Silverando. <laughs> Silver Andy. I I just love I how who that is. I wonder, I wonder who that is. Is that Gildan Britches? No. Oh, she's not even wearing pants. I'm even more wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I love it when like statues are like whoa. whoa. Jeez. I'm sorry. The look of the fucking dude. No. <laughs> Wait a no. I'm trying to figure out the thing that he asked. <laughs> no, I know, but I was just looking at the look of the voice actor. Yeah, oh yeah. yeah, yeah. For the... <laughs> for Mace <laughs> I see the face and it suddenly makes sense. He literally has no other lines besides grunting and screaming. By the way, it's Shy Matheson. Shy Matheson. Like Shy's in... S-H-A-I. He's good for... <laughs> he looks like you would voice Silvando. <laughs> Let's see who else he's evil. Nothing. Wow. Nothing. Very, uh, what's the word? Presumptuous. Presumptuous and kind of racist. <laughs> he's white! <laughs> I have no idea who that New is. Ball? No, I'm just, I'm just, <laughs> I'm just, uh, he's, uh, in Final Fantasy. We still hurt. Uh, not hey, look as hurt. Look at the map, look at the map, what's the map say? The map Eric, Eric and, and Mia's, Mia's shelter. shelter. I wonder who Mia is. <laughs> you know, I don't care to know. <laughs> I'm gonna kill these giant puppy cats. Puppy cats. They look like they're dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> what perfect timing that was. I'm just gonna have Rab keep doing that. <laughs> Things are looking up. Yeah! Run them over so you can get experience that way. I don't have my horse. Yes, you do. <laughs> <laughs> now let's get Pink Typhoon! And then see what this does. It's just more charm. Oh, I mean, I mean, uh, it's a moon! Sends a minxy wink sailing towards all enemies that will sometimes put them to sleep and can also restore HP. That was the move that she was hitting us with that put us to sleep. Oh! We're getting her that. <laughs> We're really getting her that. I just love how statues, like, in public places can... Like, they have their own, like, wear on them. Except for the areas that a bunch of people, like, touch when they're walking by it. Like, some, like a bunch of dog statues, their people pet the dog statues. Mm -hmm. So it's a lot more gold. But then... <laughs> but then in the worst scenario, there's a... Woman statues. <laughs> yeah. What's wrong with the woman statue? There's you specific, know what's touched. specific areas of them that get um polished a lot more. <laughs> people people be grabbing them rocky titties. Gold. I love gold. Run it over gold. with your horse. Ah. <laughs> but this is fun. <laughs> Fabulous! Now that you've murdered that innocent child, Jade, Jade, I want to, uh, Jade, what is it, Roaring Tyrant? A sauce-fueled strike on a single enemy. <laughs> Instead of puff puff, it's called buff buff. What are the? <laughs> <laughs> and it's must, a sauce-fueled strike. I must know what are the uh, the uh, the power up abilities between these two. Step on my balls. What the fuck? What the fuck? Step on my balls. It doesn't do any damage to the enemy. <laughs> There's, uh, you know, you know the skill progression in, uh, in, in the Dragon Quest, or like the, the spells and shit. Yeah. Right, cusses. It's like sizz, cusses, cussizzle. Yeah. So it's, it's step on my balls, stomp on my balls, cuss stomp on my balls. Cuss stomp on my balls. <laughs> I'm just having to literally just beat this bear to death. Actually, I want to see what cussizzle. Like. First thing I think of when you say it's when you just kept going off, bigger. first thing I think of when you kept going off was just of um, 
uh, that uh, terrorizer song with Nogla, uh, Shave, Shave My, my balls. balls. Yeah, this bear, though, fucked in the health. Yeah. Quick, someone don't dance! <laughs> there we go, we're all good now. All the people who are at, <laughs> at full health are now still at full health. <laughs> are now at more health. Big Typhoon! Whoa! That was cool. That was 200 damage. Yeah. That was easy. No, uh, Jensen, don't use me. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, that was 300 damage. Hey, let me jack you. <laughs> <laughs> let me reward you for it. Damn, you went dun, two. Dun, dun, dun. Damn, you went for the twofer. Let's see if it happens again. <laughs> no. <laughs> Why did you so much damage last time? What the fuck? I have no idea. What? I know you weren't meaning it, but it made, made it sound like the continuation of that show. Let's get, let's see if there's more. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! I love Silvando so much. He's just such a goofy character. He's funny, but like, I'm not gonna marry him. <laughs> <laughs> no, I will. Let's go. <laughs> Magic Beast Tide. Okay, I should probably go heal before we go and do all this. That is important. Uh, that uh, is important. Uh, uh, crafting material. Actually, uh, is there a camp anywhere you can rest at? No. There's an Yggdrasil. There's an Yggdrasil thing, yes. But I will instead have to do a handy heal all. And then hopefully that stuff up ahead, when we get some story and stuff, will be healed. And hopefully there's nothing ahead that will require you to use more of your mana, hopefully. Hopefully. What if I just climb down the well? <laughs> <laughs> that is such a weird position. Like, I know that he's weeping and he's sobbing. And he's like, can't control his memories and all that kind of stuff. But just look how weird he looks right he now. He looks just... like he's going to turn around and run at you. Point, point at him and laugh. <laughs> he looks like, he looks like <laughs> the witch from the Left, Left 4 Dead series. Wait, 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 wait. Go in the well. Go in the well? Go in the well. Go in the well. Go in the well. Go in the well. Well, well, well. Somebody played what if... Uh, uh, somebody played to see if they could beat uh, all of Tears of the Kingdom with just the wells. Oh, hell yeah. They did it after a long, long time. One of the wells literally tell takes you to the castle hole that takes you to the boss. Yeah. Yeah. That's like the easiest. <laughs> Brighton Rock. Also, none of the wells are above in the Sky Island. So how did he literally play any of the game? So Woo! the beginning part, he had to do a whole like, uh, like uh, a glitch thing. Where he was able to glitch an item from a well in uh, like uh, from one uh, playthrough mm. to a new playthrough, yeah. And so he managed to do that, and so through the use of one single weapon, he was able to get through all of the Sky Island. Interesting. I was always I find it very weird whenever games are just like you have to have a weapon in order to do damage. That so you can't just punch. Yes. You, there's no unarmed damage. I find that very weird when games do that. As long as they have, like, a valid reason for it. Like, they're, they're trying to explain the fact that, like, the, the weapons have magic. <laughs> or the, the enemies that you fight have, like, scales that need dragon damage sword or whatever, you know? Yeah. Like, silver for wolves. Werewolves, yeah. But, um, but, like, the Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom, Link can't punch. He just uses the sword. But everything has a weapon durability, so sometimes you literally just have nothing. Yeah. Especially the beginning. Right. You should be able to punch. Hi, Eric. Are you sad? Yeah, I hate weapon derpling. I was here and so was Arr, my fucking dick. Oh, I mean, my head. Wrong head. The poor boy's in a bad way. Did something happen to him here when he was younger, do you think? Perhaps we could find something here about that'll jog his memory. Come on, laddie. Let's have a look around. What? <laughs> Could that perhaps ye the leaves will tell the story? <laughs> that are not from Yggdrasil. <laughs> Touch. A I high Yggdrasil root. What I the fuck? I like how it's still here and still working. Even though Yggdrasil is dead. Dead. Like actually dead. <sighs> He's still not in uniform. It's not even a <gasps> smaller version of him. What's the matter, runt? Tired? You soon will be. <laughs> No, Gambino! You got a problem, boy? 
We've been looking after your brats for ten long years. Ever since we found you freezing in that snowfield. You owe us your lives. So how about you start showing us some respect? Without us, you never would have unlocked Super Saiyan yes, Blue. Chief. <laughs> Sorry, Chief. You don't have to be a dick about it. I like how the only thing Viking he had on him was the was the helmet. Yeah, he was just white. And like he didn't even I have like furs. Is. In trouble again? You know what your problem is, dear brother? You need to learn to grovel more convincingly. That's a weird voice for Silvando. <laughs> That's a weird voice for an eight-year-old to have. Whoa! She's dead. Hey, Mia. I know how you feel, though. I hate their big fat guts as much as you do. <gasps> like Benerk? Uh, oh. Uh. Oh, don't be such a scaredy cat. Just hurry up and finish your work so we can go home. Tell you what, since I'm such a good sister, I'll stick around and cheer you on. <clears throat> Help! <laughs> <laughs> the only reason the chief's working me so hard today is because you got caught with your hand in his coin purse. You could at least help. <laughs> Make me. <laughs> there we go. Okay. <laughs> what the? Me and my big mouth. Yeah. Thanks for the help, Mia. Guy sang the hedgehog and his little sister. Shanik the Shanik the whorehog. Whoa! 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 Oh, not that again. Still, I guess it's good to have a dream. I have a dream. Why does he have earrings but she doesn't? Cuz he's older. One of these days, we're going to get our hands on a whole pile of treasure. And then we can wave this lousy place goodbye. Or you could just leave. <laughs> Forget a pile. I'm not gonna stop till I've got myself a mountain. What about a molehill? <laughs> you can make it into a mountain. Aha! <sighs> <laughs> oh, that's unrealistic. First, we gotta find something to eat. Seagull. Interesting. If we had wings, we could fly away from here. Oh no, he's not gonna try it. Whatever we wanted. Uh, uh, what are you? Five? You won't be flying anywhere on an empty stomach. <laughs> you know what I think when I look at that thing? Dinner. She's got the right idea. <laughs> she got the survival monkey brain. I heard that seagull does not taste good. <laughs> Mm. No, cause those fuckers will eat anything. Man Ray. It's just like the I I I thought it was I thought it was Eric talking. So it's just as the priest said, Eric used to live here with his wee sister, slaving away for the Vikings. Looked like they had a tough time of it. His sister's name was Mia, was it not? This shack must have been their home. If you caught that. <laughs> Hi, bear. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Go on, laddie. Try touching the root again. Maybe it'll show us a bit more of their past. I like how I was talking to Eric, but Rab talked to me. Where's Rab? I don't know. In your shadow. Grandpa? Grandpa? <laughs> yeah. They just explode out. No! <laughs> There's no way the game tells you to do it again. It, it, it could have literally gives you just... a cut gives you a cutscene. Hey, um, keep watching. <laughs> you, should, you should keep watching. <laughs> so, is, are they like ten and eight years old, or? Eric's still sixteen, and she's eight. <laughs> <laughs> she's like twelve, fourteen. They act like teenagers. Huh? And Eric looks exactly the same. He's wearing different I'm, clothes. I'm a, double check, younger. I'm a double check it, but I did look it up, and it was something, something like 17 or 16. <laughs> for her. Birthday's complete without a present, right? Nah. 
Happy birthday, sis. I stole this fancy jewelry from this old lady to give it to you for your birthday. A rusty old necklace? Honestly, Eric, you need to try harder. I'm grateful. What I really wanted was the red orb of Heliodor. Ah. It's a ruby the size of my head. Ah. But she still likes her because she's well, a sister. The word is that necklace has special powers. They say that whoever wears it will find gold at their fingertips wherever they go. She's already gone. <laughs> probably just talk, but it seemed about right for a little money grubber like you. I guess you'll just have to put it on and find out if. <laughs> what the fuck? She's got the Midas touch. <gasps> it's the Midas necklace. It was a copper coin a minute ago, but as soon as I touched it, it. It. <laughs> if I found out someone had golden touch power, I'd be like, "Yeah, don't touch me. Don't ever touch. Don't, me. don't touch me. You can touch this. <laughs> that was my blanket. Shut up. No one was talking." How did the old lady not turn Eric into gold? Oh, oh boy. <laughs> Man, I should have worn that fucking necklace. <laughs> oh, she metaphorically died. For Midas, the reason he was so upset was not because he turned his daughter to gold, but because he touched his dick and... <laughs> oh! <laughs> it was not That's fun. That's that golden blanket on the floor right there. Oh! Mm -hmm. It was not fun when he went to go sleep with a chick, and then he just heard clang, 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 clang. You, you know what I see with when I look over there with the lighting and everything that's been happening piss? with the game? It looks like either piss or literally like viscera, like blood and, and guts and everything. Viscera. Yeah. <laughs> but it's gold. Why is everyone looking at me? Because Eric's talking. <laughs> Because it was all your fault. <laughs> we have no choice! <laughs> Eric and his sister might have wound each other up, but it's plain as the nose on your face that they cared, about, uh, cared for each other very deeply. After all, he wouldn't have brought her back his, back the necklace if he didn't care. The necklace that turned everything she touched into gold. No less. Why is Rab narrating? It's a mighty like powerful... he was there. <laughs> That's a powerful thing to put in the hands of a young lassie like her. Go on now, try touching the usual route again. I'm keen to see how the story ends. Man, it can't just be one cutscene. That, <laughs> that is very weird. That is very strange. It, honestly, how to avoid the 20 minute cutscenes? <laughs> Slice them up. <laughs> you choose yeah, when to watch it again. Each. Yeah. Now everything else is gold. And when everything's gold, nothing's gold. Been at it again, huh? <laughs> What's the matter, Eric? Jealous of my treasures? Tell you what. You know who she reminds you? Or really, Young Bulma. Really That's what like I was from, from like her. the hairstyle. Yeah. The hair color. Maybe not the top knot, but the way her hair is like tied up and shit. Uh, yeah. She looks like Bulma. Ah, perfect. No, I'm nostalgic as fuck. Duke, I'm still your dragon ball monger. <laughs> Bird. Right, I'll give you the suitcase. Oh god. Bird. Bird. Wait. <laughs> you Mia this isn't right shut up oh. <laughs> I forget how greedy you are seriously Mia no Eric goes but morality and she goes oh and it turns to gold <laughs> she, yeah. <laughs> she puts her hand on her head and just think like that one meme of the dude the <laughs> she's just stuck in that pose yeah. <laughs> don't touch me Thumbnail. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, just a bird. <laughs> dead fucking golden bird. Okay, okay, I get it. I guess I have been getting a little carried away. 
Just stop looking at me like that, will you? Stop looking at me like I'm a monster. Get away! Oh! all <laughs> <laughs> Like every time, like the sisterly push away, like instantly just, turn him into one. No, no, it's fine. I'll stop turning stuff into gold. For now. That means when you're not around. It will never come off. Ever again. It is gold. Why won't it... What's wrong? The necklace. It won't come off. Come on, Mia. Stop fooling around. You stupid. Take it off. <laughs> I'm serious. I can't get it off. You guys like the film grain and all the memories? No, I actually really hate it. Yeah, me too. Uh oh. What's happening now? I didn't do anything, I swear. Eric just had to give his little sister the Majora's mask, didn't he? <laughs> oh no! Oh! Don't move. That's lucky. going on oh she's dying I'm turning to gold help me why is your voice resonating like that I don't sound right her lungs and throat and uh Damn it. voice what do I do? box box is turning into gold row row Ruh row, Rarick. No, you're turning into rolled. <laughs> and I gotta keep checking. He's like, am I going to do it? Fuck. <laughs> oh! She's gold as hell. What are you sad about? <laughs> What's his problem? <laughs> what is bro yapping about? That was the last time he saw her. Turn around, she's right behind you. <laughs> but we're gonna be, we're gonna <laughs> what <did I> know? <laughs> But we're gonna be figuring out what happens next time. Thank you everybody so much for watching. If you liked it, subscribe for more and we'll catch ya next time. His sister's In the next episode of Dragon. Yes. Ball. Listen, West. laddie. <laughs> Listen, laddie. If you touch the plant again, then you'll get some showgirls. <laughs> <Woo! laughs> Alright. Bye.